Shalom, science family. So this morning we're going to be making some gummies, um, the little candies that the kids like. So you can do this for a fraction of the cost. What you see in here is uh, fresh peaches that I've just cut and I've put into a simple syrup, which is um, half water, half sugar. And I've uh, brought it to a boil um, in my peaches to extract to extract the flavor of my peaches into my solution into my simple syrup so now all we're going to do is add in um, this gelatin powder it's a plant-based gelatin powder add to some cold water and once this comes to a, a little bit more of a simmer then what I'm going to do is add in my gelatin and then we can go ahead and blend this down or should I do that now? Let's blend this down white before it comes to a boil. One second. Okay, all I did was put it into my Nutri Blender or Bullet or whatever you want to call this little thing. And I'm going to pour it back into my pot. And you can see it has turned into a puree now. All right, and that's exactly the consistency. And so I'm now gonna just let this come continue to boil as I mix my gelatin powder. And I'm gonna use half a teaspoon of the powder mixed in with um, two tablespoons of cold water. All right. So I'm just going to give this a mix in my measuring cup here and then we're going to go ahead and just pour that directly into this. Now I'm just going to stir and let this become a little thick and then we're going to go ahead and shake this and put these into our molds. Just like so. So these will be peach flavored gummies. We're gonna bring this up to a boil and then we'll move on. Just kind of continue to stir as it thickens. So this is just, again, ways of saving money instead of running out and buying all of these things for seven and eight dollars and you get a limited supply, you can buy some lemons, or not lemons, your, your fruit. I have peaches, fresh peaches. Just buy the peaches. I didn't even take the skin off. I just peeled it right down with the skin on into the halves, slices, and boiled it into my simple, simple syrup. Once it came into my simple syrup, as you saw, I added my um, agara, agara agara uh, powder, which is our gelatin, and to some cold water, and then right into this pot to come to a good boil, like so. Okay, as you see, it's a good rolling boil now, and I'm just going to just continue to give it a a little mix. I turned my fire down some because it was getting a little out of hand. Something didn't get mixed good, but okay, I think it's a peach. But anyway, so there we go. Now we're just going to take this right on over to our molds. I'm going to turn the fire off and let it come down to a little bit of a cool so it don't burn me. My, my peaches didn't all puree, but that's okay. That's okay. All right. I'm trying to think of which is the best way to do this. Let me try. So I'm going to use these little syringes that came with my mold. Okay, family. So I'm just going to take my syringe and put it into my gummy uh, liquid. And we're just going to pipe this right into the molds, bringing it all the way up to the top as close as you can. Well, 
like so. This can be boring, so I won't bore you with letting you watch me pipe all of this in. I'll be back once I get it done. Okay, so I have most of my molds filled. Once this comes to a complete set, I'll be back to show you as I pop them out. Okay, family, so I saved you the problem of watching me pop all of these little gummies out. So they are here. Now I'm just gonna put them in my silicone uh, storage bag and they'll be ready for when they are wanting uh, a sweet treat. So they have the, the peach gummies now and I'll make more as we need them. Let me grab another bag. And just throw them away. You can put them in the uh, refrigerator or you can keep them in the in your pantry i'd much rather keep if i can get them in here i'd much rather keep them in the refrigerator that way um i don't have to worry about them because you have to remember these don't have preservatives so they're not like your gummies that you buy in the store that can sit on the shelf or on the counter somewhere and just stay fresh forever these are not they these are natural and they're made in home and they're your first treats. Shalom.